Okay, so this is a Pioneer Avic 1500 Nex. If you guys know what I'm talking about, this is this is it, Pioneer Nav Avic 1500 Nex. This is an aftermarket car stereo, and uh, we got a little problem here, and um, I can't seem to figure this out. So I decided to come to YouTube. Now um, I'm gonna power this thing up, and in general, I'm gonna tell you guys what I'm talking about. Is uh, I don't know what bastard decided it would be a good idea to put a password on a car stereo, but someone will must some smart ass must have been like, let's put a password on a car stereo. So we got a, so we got this here, which does include a password to get in. Now the problem is, is that I don't remember the password. Um, it gives you hints like high school 61 or whatever that was. Let me come down here actually. <laughs> so it says like it gives you hints like high school 61 or whatever. So I mean, I mean, I, I don't know how to get past this little password thing. Um, there's a little reset button clear up here. Can't even see it, but there's a small little password or a little not password button, but there's a little reset button right there. I tried that. It don't work. I've tried disconnecting the battery for 24 hours. That doesn't work. Um, I've looked up on YouTube how to fix this. I haven't found it tutorial yet or anything how to fix or get past this password entry stereo haven't figured that out yet so um i really have no idea how to get through this now there is a way to get past this apparently obviously send it to pioneer and have them res re reset the memory inside of there wipe out the memory obviously that brings it completely back to a whole new stereo or whatever but obviously that probably is going to cost some money and so uh i'm just trying to do whatever i can to see if it works or anything before i send it in a little button up here I don't really know what that does. It's a small little square. I really don't know what that does. I don't know how well you guys can see that. Looks like a square button right there next to the reset button. Don't know what that little guy does. But other than that, I've tried this uh, multiple times. I've tried like the hint what it gives you so i type in uh, high school or whatever this says hint high school 61 or whatever so i really have no idea this is really tricky so i obviously called pioneer and i said i got a stereo you know it's got the password on it and i can't get through and they said, well, the only way to really reset it is you gotta so or you gotta send it to them and they gotta wipe out the memory inside of it. Now, this is a new stereo and all, so I don't have um I don't have anything set up in here. But um so technically, um I don't well I haven't even been inside of the stereo yet actually. Or you know what I'm saying, like I haven't played with the stereo yet. So I don't have anything that I need to save or anything. So um, I'm fine with that if they have to wipe the memory. But it's the only way to get through to it. Well, it sucks. I've tried holding down like different buttons and of course it don't work. So yeah, this thing is just kind of definitely, definitely strange. I don't know.